The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship. And guys, I hope Santa was good to you this morning. Oh, he's always good to me, Cole. Though, I'm pretty sure Saxton ended up with Cole in his stocking. This is going to be good. Get ready, guys. Big time singles matches coming up here. And I can assure you these two superstars have been waiting all day to get their hands on each other. If John Cena keeps that ruthless aggression that he once showed against Kurt Angle, the future is going to be very bright for this young man. Oh, without... Introducing the challenger from Houston, Texas, weighing in at 251 pounds, Becca R. T. Introducing the champion from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 248 pounds, he is the United States Champion, John Cena! This has all the makings of a legendary night. And we're underway. Yeah. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Big time slam. Vicious. Hooked up. You gotta believe this one's over. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Ooh, what impact. Shoulder tackle. Punch right to the face. Got 
Guys, a loss here for the champion would be incredibly embarrassing, especially considering all the trash talking I'm told has been going on behind the scenes. I don't want to reveal my sources, but let's just say there's been some pretty harsh words being tossed around. Challenger starting to falter. So much on the line here in the match for him. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. Wow. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. I don't know who your sources are, Corey, but it wouldn't surprise me at all to learn that the champion has been a little cocky heading into this one. And there's nothing wrong with that, Michael, especially considering just how dominant the champ has been of late. When you're that good, you have every right to bow your chest out a little bit. Slam with authority. Walking around the city earlier today, guys, the only thing anybody was talking about was this title match. Everywhere I went, from the coffee shop to the bookstore, everybody was talking about this match. Oh my goodness, this hurts. Oh! He's going for the pin. He got body on body there, but that's about it. Definitely has his work cut out for him. Nope, reverses it. Byron, I had a similar experience as you this morning. Nearly every person at the gym I went to was talking about this title match, and rightfully so. This is an absolutely huge match. Okay, wait, wait. Let me get this straight. Byron spent the morning at the bookstore while you, Cole, went to the gym. Man, that's brilliant. You guys have any other jokes? Nailed it. Oh boy, he is wrong. Oh, nasty impact. Believe it or not, fellas, some people are speculating whether the champ should have to defend the gold against what some are calling inferior competition here tonight. Corey, I think you're just trying to drum up controversy. I haven't heard any whispers about the champion having to defend against inferior competition. Yeah, inferior competition? That's nuts. I'm willing to bet the champ started that rumor in an attempt to get into his opposition's head. Either that, or Corey's just making stuff up, as you alluded to, Michael. John Cena with a nice reversal. Vicious strike. I know anything is possible, but I just can't envision a new champ being crowned here tonight. The champ just comes into tonight with too much momentum. Uh-oh, he's in trouble here. He wants no part of this. Now that's what I call making a statement. The champion is victorious. A hard fought victory. Yeah, big win for that young man. And wait a minute. What's he thinking now? He's thinking he's not finished. He wants to stomp a hole in him. Corey, this match is over.
to the ring at a combined weight of 564 pounds, Bubba Ray Dudley and Devin Dudley, the Dudley Boys. Byron, what can we expect to see from these two teams here tonight? Michael, I fully expect to see these two teams put on an absolute clinic in tag team competition. That's how good these teams are. At a combined weight of 471 pounds, Rick and Charlie Haas. Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting teams ready to go here tonight in tag team action. And I can tell you that the entire tag team division has eyes on this match right now. That's how big this one is. Tell you what, Michael, I'm not going to lie. These two make an awesome tag team. I cannot wait for this match. Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. Man, this card is just packed with so many great matches, and this one is definitely among the most anticipated, I'd say. Fist drop! Man! Years later, I still get goosebumps when I watch the WWE pay-per-view. It takes me back to when I was a kid. My friends would come over to watch WrestleMania or SummerSlam. this arena tonight, there appear to be plenty of youngsters in attendance who will undoubtedly look back at this night with great fun, as much like Byron did when he watched WWE pay-per-views in his youth. Don't sleep on the true headline of Saxon's little antidote there, Cole. He actually said he had friends come over to his house. I think we need to fact-check that one, because I'm not buying it. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. What a strike! Guys, there's something special about competing on a WWE pay-per-view event. Sure, having a match on Raw or SmackDown is absolutely amazing, but there's nothing quite like the bright lights of a WWE pay-per-view. Michael, there's nothing like the bright lights of a WWE pay-per-view, but there's also nothing like the pressure of competing on a WWE pay-per-view. A loss here could set you back quite a bit. Yeah, but a win, now that could be career changing. Think about it, picking up a win while the entire WWE Universe is watching on the WWE Network, it doesn't get much better than that. Say, I don't remember the last time I heard a more passionate crowd than the one we have here tonight. They are clearly fired up to have this pay-per-view in their arena. 
Oh, guys, there's the slam! Nasty impact. Harsh impact. In addition to this crowd being incredibly passionate here tonight, so are our fans watching at home. In fact, it's because of them I've learned that this match is currently the number one trend worldwide on social media. That's pretty amazing. Oh, here it comes! Oh, man, that hurt. Got every ounce of that one. This could be over. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Look at this. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Does not want to be there. Oh, 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 what a boot. Beautiful technique. He's not looking like himself here. Headed into this match, he and his partner look extremely tough. This is sickening to watch. The ref had no choice but to call the match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Undisputed Championship. The Dead Man Cometh. What the? I don't think we're going to wait for the match to start. And before the match can even begin, we have a brawl on our hands. Wow, that's a heck of a holiday present for the WWE Universe. Ooh, what impact. Set him up.
Seals action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. Jeez. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. Oh. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Irish whip. Blues line. He wants to do this in the ring. Using the elbow as a weapon. Not looking good for the champ here. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one-on-one -on -one atmosphere where he thrives. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. Side slam! In WWE, there's as much chaos outside the ring as there is inside the ring. Try working with Saxton at ringside. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Look at this. right off the apron. Whoa, the Undertaker dodged that one. He's making a statement here with this attack. Now back to the ring. Nailed it. Undertaker staring knives into his opponent. We've seen champions head into matches maybe a little too confident, only to be picked off in the end. And guys, I can't help but wonder if we're going to see that again here tonight. He wants to do this in the ring. The champion into the cover. Undertaker kicks out with ease. He may be the dead man, but Taker ain't laying down for anybody. Speaking of champions heading into matches a bit overconfident, one of the most glaring examples of that would have to be the Honky Tonk Man's attitude heading into his Intercontinental Championship defense at SummerSlam 1988. We all... Uh-oh. Going for the run. Smoke slam! Can he finish the job? Toss to the outside. This could be it. Taker setting it up. Taker has him up. Here we go. Rest in peace. I knew it was only a matter of time. He wants no part of the outside. 
This superstar is dangerous both inside and outside the ring. When this guy's on, look out. I think we know what this is. Swing neckbreaker. What a comeback. He has him right where he wants him. Here we go. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Oh, right to the side of the face. Here we go. The Undertaker is setting it up. He's close to being done here. Tombstone! Pile driver! Here's his mark. Shoulders down, this could be it. Unbelievable. This singles match is over. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. Some pretty good give and take in this match, as these highlights show. Overall, this match was average at best. But not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. And last but not least... check in the win column for Undertaker. Hey, they both gave it their all, but in the end, we were left with the best man standing. What a match, and a quick thank you to everybody for spending part of their Christmas with us here at the WWE.